Hi guys, welcome to Plain and Simple. I am so glad you decided to join me today for our first Walmart fall haul video. Um, there are so many things in store that I loved and online that I really think I need to break this into like three or four videos. So over the next few months, stay tuned. I think we're gonna be, you're gonna be seeing me do like four Walmart videos. Um, Walmart videos are super popular and there's just so many great affordable items that great outfits so I think we're all gonna really enjoy that um, I got mostly everything in store one thing online I think I have one thing from Target to share with you because I, I seem to always have to do that right just throw in something from somewhere else I picked up a really cute top I just want to share it with you so that's that's just that um, and last time my last video that I did this tripod um, format seemed to be really popular so we're gonna do that and I'm going to feature the shoes and the pants in the end um, you'll kind of see the pants that I'm wearing but I'm, I'm really gonna focus on those in the end of the video to, so you can see them better um, but yeah let's get started with the try -on. this first top is from no boundaries it's flannel um, I love it it's got like a pull string and a hood uh, buttons down. This is a size medium and it's about $15. Um, I love how it has a hood in the back. I think that just looks so sporty. I don't usually see flannels that have hoods, so I thought this was really cute. Um, these are a pair of pants I'll be showing you in, in the end. They're really, really high-waisted, um, and I'm not sure of the brand, so we'll get into that later. Um, let's see how this is untucked. So it is long enough to wear with leggings. And the sleeves have really cool detail here with, with the button and the loop and how that um, kind of holds it up and gives it a little bit of a really nice, interesting um, sleeve. I like that. So that's really cute and it kind of rolls up by itself. So let's see how it looks in the back. So it's definitely long enough for leggings if you wanted to wear this in leggings. This is a medium. Um, if you wanted a little more oversized for leggings, a large I think would be really good too. So again, here's how it's and give it a little front tuck there. You can even kind of roll it in the back so it's not long. Super comfortable. I think even a large would be great in this. Um, give it a little bit more room, but I, I like the fit of it for sure. So here is my the next sweater. They have several different color patterns in these. Um, a plain gray, which I will show you next, but I really love this gray with the brown sweater. It is so soft. This is in a size small, and it is, I left these tags on, $11.44 for this sweater. That's pretty amazing. Um, I love this. It's so soft. You can kind of wear it just like this. And I'm usually medium, so the small fit me great. And I have a, a 36 chest, if that helps at all. So, yeah, I think this is really pretty. You could tuck it. And I love it. I'm going to back up so you can kind of see. I love, I love it with these pants. Um, they're time and true and I will like I said from the end and I have um, the mules on from Old Navy I don't know if you can see those or not I will show you at the end so we're not so far away and can't see um, but this sweater is seriously adorable for $11 and it is so soft and they have so many different colors like I said everything is linked below so you'll be able to check that out online as well if you don't have these in store okay so that was just changing into this sweater and I realized I didn't put any lipstick on and I'm definitely not gonna go back and re-record all of this video over lipstick um, so yeah that's why I'm wearing li lipstick now my favorite color so I'm like well if we're gonna talk about it then I'm gonna share it um, it is the CoverGirl Outlast in Universal Nude it stays on all day I love this so much and then you put the balm on after it dries um, I did talk about this in my my makeup products my I think it's like 22 favorite makeup products video I did a couple videos back so if you want to check that out go ahead um, but yes I love this lipstick it's such a beautiful nude color so yes if you're interested I will link that below um, so here is the same gray sweater um, in the same sweater uh, as the stripe one the last one that I had just shown you in soft gray it is so soft like let me let me try to show you how soft just so so soft super soft sweater it's beautiful I for 20 what $23 $24 for two sweaters that is such a good deal um, I love the soft gray I am definitely keeping both of these sweaters and these pants um, anyway so yeah here it is tucked out you can wear it like that it's definitely not long enough for leggings okay if you want to wear your leggings like that you go ahead um, yeah, 
So I think this is a really, really pretty outfit. So here's a really cute, um, this is not a flannel. This is more of a very lightweight um, plaid shirt. Uh, definitely not like the flannel material. It's, I would say it's somewhere in between, uh, like super lightweight and a flannel. They also have these, um, the button cuff sleeves here, which I love because it helps keep your sleeve up and not have to worry about it falling down. Um, yeah, I really like this. I think this is really cute. Size medium. I think it's about $15. I just gave it a little tie. I left the bottom one unbuttoned and tied. And I just rolled it under all the way around. That's one way to wear it. Um, obviously, you know, just leave it out. Put uh, like a tank top underneath that, which I think would be really cute. Um, I can show that. Actually, I'll, I will show that next. But here is what it looks like out. All the way around. And then obviously you could just do your little front tuck. But these pants are really high waisted. So I think um, you know, for a shirt like this, yes, I think this is cute, but um maybe just more low waisted pants would look better with the front tuck as well. Alright, so this top, they had these last year, um, a bunch of different colors, and I picked up a few of them. I love them, I still wear them, um, but I love this beautiful, it's almost like a rust cinnamon color, kind of a little deeper than that coral color that I love. What a beautiful color for fall. Um, this is the waffle neck texture, uh, the buttons that do not work on these tops. Oh, they do work this year. They they didn't work last year. Now I have to go check my, my shirts to make sure and see if that's the truth. Well, guess what, ladies? If you're breastfeeding, open so that's wonderful um, a, a subscriber had reminded me when I had talked about a, a top in the last video that unbuttoned I said for whatever reason if you want to unbutton it she's like well for breastfeeding I'm like oh my gosh yes it's been a really long time guys so completely forgot about that so great for uh, breastfeeding moms here at this top um, but yeah they have these in all different colors uh, I think they're just really pretty super comfortable casual the waffle knit um, it's, it's really just like wearing thermal obviously um, but, you know, it gives it a little bit more of a feminine touch with the, the v-neck and the buttons. And I do like these in a size medium, um, my normal true to size. Um, and I have uh, just paired them with these black pants that I will show you in a second, a little bit more close up when we get off tripod. Alright, so I did want to talk about this top I grabbed from Target yesterday. This video will be going up today. It is Sunday. Um, I don't remember which day it is. I think it's like the 13th or something. No. It's the 15th because it was there was a Friday the 13th. That's the way I remember things, right? Um, it is a really adorable, and this is flannel. Um, they were on sale for like $15, so I had to grab it. I love the color. It reminds me of like a boyfriend um, color, like a, something that your boyfriend or husband would wear. Um, and that's why I think it looks really nice with like a white tank top underneath. It just kind of makes it more feminine. Um, this is a, one of those white tank tops I got from Walmart. I think they're like $2 or something. This is in a size small, but I definitely think I need an extra small. I want it to be more fitted. Um, I usually wear a medium, so um, if that's where your sizing is, you might want to size down two sizes as well if you want more of a fitted tank top. But yeah, here it is. You can wear it untucked. This is how long it is. This flannel is a size small. So if you want more oversized, definitely go up. Um, and obviously you could just button it and front tuck it. That would be cute too. Um, but yeah, I definitely love, love it with the white tank top underneath. I think it gives it a little bit more of a feminine touch. All right, so here's this adorable teddy bear coat. Um, it has like a little drawstring in the bottom here. And it zips up. It's so like a quarter zip and it's super soft and the, the best thing about it is it's soft on the inside as well this is a size medium i could probably do a size large if i wanted to be a little bit more oversized super soft really comfortable let's see how it goes it's like i said it's an elastic band all the way around so an elastic there um but yeah really cozy and they have more colors than, than just black i just i just grabbed the black one because i thought you know i don't usually wear anything in black so i thought i would grab black something black but yeah, this is really soft and comfortable. Um, I think this would look cute with a pair of skinny jeans and a high pair of boots um, for the, the fall, fall when it gets a little bit more cold outside. All right, so before we go any further, I wanted to um, show you these pants. They are from Time and True. I got them in a size four. Um, I love how high-waisted they are. 
uh, my belly button is like right there. It's like right at my belly button. That's how high they are. But they're just really, really adorable. Super comfortable. Um, I think I could possibly do a two um, just to get them to be more fitted. I, I have been wearing them over the past hour and they have started to loosen up a little bit. Uh, so, if I don't know. I would say you might want to size down one size if you want them a little tighter and to loosen up or if you just want them to be loose and comfortable then just go with your regular size. But yeah, I love the buttons. They're like a rose gold color. They're really pretty. Um, I, I think this would look really cute if you had like a button top, like a three down button top with it to kind of match. Um, and then these mules are just the shoes that I showed um, in my old navy try on. Well, it was Old Navy Target, my last one, and that I um, featured there. I love these so much. They're so comfortable. I wear them everywhere. I get compliments on them. I will link them below. And they do have them in Leopard as well. Um, yeah, so these are the jeans. They're really cute and comfortable. And I think they're just a great, like, early fall pants. All right, so here's my final outfit. This really adorable cardigan um, from... From Time and True, $13, $14. Um, I got it in a size small. They have several colors. Um, I just paired it with the white tank top that I definitely need an extra small in and these jeans that I grabbed from store in store. They're Time and True. Um, and they have this really awesome waistband. Let me get closer. It's very slimming for the tummy. If you can see that. There's nothing there to, you know, to pull. It's like it's almost like maternity pants, which is amazing. And they have little buttons here, so it gives a little bit of detail. Um, and these are in a size small, which is 4, 6. And they're definitely too big for me. Um, I think if you are a size 6, these would be perfect for you. Um, I need an extra small, but I don't know if they have them. Um, I just rolled the cuff. I will actually unroll the cuff and show you these pants um, with the mules so you can see what they are, how they are. They're a very straight leg pant. And these shoes are adorable, these booties. I got them in store. Um, and you know what? This is not my last outfit. I just lied to you. I actually have another um, sweater that I got online that I have to show you. So yes, I take that back. Um, these are really, really, really comfortable. I got them in a size 8. Um, I will show them a little bit better in just one second. I just want to kind of show you how they are um, with the roll cuff and the booty here. Oh, the lighting is not the greatest right now. Um, sorry about that. But yeah, these are really, really comfortable. I got them in a size 8, my regular size. And I got a pair of these from Time and True last year in black. And man, they're so comfortable. Uh, let me show you down like this so you can see the color. If that's going to focus, yes it is. And how cute and adorable that those little side buckles are. Just a really great color for fall. I love the cognac color. Yeah, I think these are really cute. I love the, the round toe. They're, they're very sexy. I think this outfit is like really cute with this too. But everything needs to just be a little smaller, um, except for the cardigan. The cardigan is perfect. I love this color for fall and spring. I think it's such a nice color. Uh, this would be pretty with that um, orange shirt, that cinnamon rust colored shirt underneath this. It would be really pretty as well. Um, maybe with just some like plain shoes, just like those mules or whatnot. But yeah, let me unroll these and show you them with the mask. All right, so I am super glad that I did not forget this sweater. Um, sorry, I don't know why I'm not focusing. Um, this is really pretty. I love the color. It's the same colors as the other ones, like more of rust um, cinnamon color. Um, it's actually, it's in a size medium, but I think I might be able to do a small. It's a little cropped. I love how it's a shorter sweater. I don't have any short. Everything's a little bit longer. Um, and it's it's heavy. It's got like a thickness to it. Let's see if we can focus and zoom in on that. Yeah, I think you can see the color. It's it's a thicker. I thought it was going to be more of a, a thin sweater. Um, it looks really cute with these black pants. Oh come on, help me out here. There we go. Come on. There we go. Looks really cute with these black pants. If they were tighter. Um, yeah, you can unbutton this, and I kept that white tank top underneath this. So um, I think I might want this in a size small. And like I said, I'm I'm usually a medium. But yeah, that looks really pretty with the white tank top underneath that. And here are these pants just rolled down with the mules. So you can kind of see um, the length of them and how they're just like a straight leg. They're very baggy on me, um, but I think they're really comfortable. If they have these in an extra small, I would love them. These would be great for work and just for, for whatever. 
just kind of doing whatever. But yeah, there's kind of like the back of the butt there and the back of the sweater if you can see it. But yeah, I love this sweater. This would look really pretty with those um, jeans as well. Especially since it's such a high sweater, um, then you can kind of leave it and not worry about having to tuck anything in. Am I just moving around too much? I'm sorry about that. And here are those booties a little bit more close up. I think those are really great quality. Um, something I feel like I could just pick up at Target as well. And I think the price, I'm going to be like $24, so that's not too bad. Targets are usually about $10 more than that. Okay guys, so that is it for my first Walmart fall haul video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a like. It really does help me uh, know that I am on track and I'm giving you guys the videos that you like. And if you are not a subscriber, please consider subscribing to my channel. I would love to have you join me. Hit that subscribe button, ring that bell so you're notified when I upload new content. And if you are still listening, if you're still here, what I would also love is it if you would comment in, in the comments below and let me know where you're watching from. Or any other comment, obviously. I, I love your comments. Um, I am from Michigan. I currently live in Pennsylvania. And I'd love to hear where you're watching from. So if you'd let me know, that would be awesome. Um, and please stay tuned. There's going to be about three more of these videos coming up. I am really looking forward to finding some more Walmart stuff. Great outfits, great prices, um, so that I can... You know, share that with you. That would be really fun as well. And I hope that you all have a wonderful day. And I will see you soon.